Plus, I'm like, get you with Jamal. We on our grind. So one day, we gonna shine. All right, y'all, let's get right into this video. It's titled, Mean Girls Shame Emo Girl in Class, but they instantly regret it. So let's check out this video, man. Uh, it's a long, dark man video, too. This one, 20 minutes long. Let's get right to it. Drawing fruit may seem simple, but pay attention to the subtleties, how the light gently wraps around the curves. Do y'all see that? She supposed to have drew that? Whoever made that art piece is, they, they got it. They got it. That's cool. The texture of the skin, the vibrant colors that breathes life into they the They all could draw like that? Oh, it's shit. the small details that transforms a sketch into a work of art. Oh. <laughs> what is Delilah wearing? I have no idea. <laughs> is it Halloween already? She dresses like a walking nightmare. <laughs> That hair looks like she got attacked by a flock of ravens. <laughs> We're gonna electrocute it. <laughs> uh, seriously, who needs that much black in their life? She probably thinks she's so edgy and cool, but she just looks ridiculous. <laughs> Did you see those spikes? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, look at me. I'm so dark and mysterious. I'm Delilah. The emo queen. <laughs> I guess she cries sad songs in her. Bro, they just made her ruin her pain. And her pain is nice. What? Don't listen to them, love. All night. <laughs> I want to be surprised. She tries way too hard. I know, right? Oh, She's pathetic. You're pathetic. Oh, my God. Well, do you have anything to say for yourself? I have no idea what's going on with you. You used to make the most beautiful drawings. Not only have you changed your art, but you've changed your whole appearance. Three months ago, I would have said you were guaranteed to win that art contest, but now I'm not sure. Do it again. Take it home. And don't destroy it with all that black. Dead Lila. <laughs> That's what her parents were thinking anyway. Right? Wow. Brooke? Amazing job. Thanks, Miss Strickland. Freak. <laughs> Loser. They gonna get this. They definitely gonna They definitely gonna get this. <laughs> Bro, I, I hate dogs that look like that. <laughs> Liking all of her photos and telling her y'all private business is not is not technically cheating, but it's definitely wrong. It's definitely wrong. That's for sure. It's emotional cheating. Oh, uh, here we go. Well, okay. She's she might be right there. It's emotional cheating for sure. My coworker. That's it. I can't believe you're making such a big deal about this whole you thing. You are always minimizing my feelings, John. That's well, you mean. invaded my privacy. Going through my messages? That's unacceptable. Yeah, well, you betrayed me and you don't even care. And you don't trust me. I don't. Our marriage is suffocating because of you, Kathy. Can you keep your voice down? Your daughter can hear you. Oh, and you're not contributing to this whole mess? Oh, yeah. You want to play me? Yeah, yeah, because you think you're so perfect. Yeah, great. It's a girlfriend. She right outside. It's Lila. Um, right look. Into her. I'm really sorry. 
Mommy and Dad are just having a really hard time right now. Can you? Yeah, it's because your mom keeps on nagging. It's because you don't take anything seriously. Yeah, well, I would take things seriously if you... Ah! Are you happy now? You're traumatizing our daughter. It's probably why she's changed her whole look. Oh, there you go. Blame me for everything. I blame you. Go ahead. being asked from me. Last yeah. Thing yes. I come home, I'm tired. And it's just like, do this, do that. Give me 15 minutes. That's all I ask for. Do you want to be a husband? Because you don't do any husband things. Do I come home and ask you to make me uh, dinner? I don't do any of that. Yeah, because I manage the stuff I'm oh, supposed to do. God. Oh, I... is always there for you. I just want peace. Okay, hey, you don't do no husband things. <laughs> Let's try that again, but without raising your voices. Obviously, we don't see eye to eye. Things have been really rough. <laughs> to say the least. Oh, see, there she goes. I, I, the, the, that's why I, I, I think the only solution why is what? just get a divorce. Oh, not the D word, not the D word. Hate to hear it. Can you two please give me a moment? Me personally, this is why I would never get married because me personally, I don't believe in divorce. Um, if I was to get married, that woman's just gonna have to be stuck with me, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> I don't know what to tell. You know, find you some safe to do. That's what I tell. <laughs> but yeah, I don't believe in divorce. Comment down below. If y'all believe in divorce, you feel me? That's like a quitter's, a quitter's mentality. I don't believe in having a quitter's mentality. You feel me? You breaking up your family, your home, and y'all relationship, and, and y'all supposed to have this unbreakable, you feel me, under God, under everything, you know, like through thick and thin, health and wealth, sick and, 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 and health, and not sick and poor and rich and all that. Y'all supposed to stay together, so it's like... If y'all supposed to stay together through hell and back, what is, what is you getting a divorce for? Y'all literally, that's literally what it says. But, to each his own. Let's continue. Speak with Delilah. Hello. 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 to be different yeah she seriously needs to chill <laughs> let's go have some fun okay <laughs> hey delilah maybe if you tried smiling for once you might scare fewer people away okay lose it <laughs> Again. Well, are you gonna 
say anything? Art is supposed to make you feel something. And your painting is making me feel depressed. It's so dark and negative. What happened to your usual colorful and expressive style? If you want a shot at winning the thousand dollar contest, I suggest you stick to the bright and beautiful, not this. Delilah, I know you're having a tough time, but sometimes during the midst of a storm, we can still find rainbows. We can still find ways to make us happy. Oh, I thought that was on silent. Um, my apologies, I put it on airplane mode. Delilah, I am here to help you through this. You can talk to me about anything if you'd like. Who is Elsa Ho? Uh, pardon me. I am in a session right now. No, thank you. Hold on. Now. You just give me a second. I need to take care of this. I am in a session right now, Kevin. Is he drunk? You cannot just come in here and barge in on me. And you cannot just keep our son from me, Rachel! This is neither the time nor the place to discuss this. I would be happy to meet you at another time, okay? No! I demand to see him! He's my kid, too. Look, just let me finish with... This guy is crazy. <laughs> you can see it in his ass. <laughs> you can always see it in the ass. He's crazy. Session, please. Let me get back to my client. I will come out and I will talk to you. We can work this out, okay? Just stay calm. I'll be waiting in the lobby. And I'll not leave until I see him. Tell me, that's how ex is. Imagine a lifetime. Ah, come on, another commercial. Not tell me, that's how ex is. Let's go. Delilah, I am so sorry you had to witness that. What about me? I had to witness it too. Is that um ex-husband? Yes. This may seem unproven. How the hell? Wait, I thought she was supposed to be like. Uh, a, a therapist or some or, or a divorce. I mean, not divorce. Uh, somebody to stop the divorce and stop breaking up them. And she got broken up. Like, what the hell is we doing here? It's like the blind leading the blind. How how she how can she coach anybody on therapy when she can she need to be coaching her life on therapy and her family, her ex husband. The blind leading the blind. What the hell is going on here? She want me, but I'd like to share some personal details about my life with you. Please do. If that's okay. Yes. Because of what okay. you just saw. Yes, please do. So my husband lost his job. Okay. And he started drinking. Right. And then he became very aggressive. Okay, we see that. So I filed for divorce, and I'm keeping our son away. That's all it took? Pay you she fell for divorce quick. This is why I can't get married, bro. What? How you just gonna give up on your husband that quick? That easy. Did you even love? Never mind. Don't 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 get started with me. No, it hasn't been easy, but we are getting through it. Wow. Um, I never would have guessed you. Seems so fine. 
And everyone has hardships. You know, the blood. health problems, financial problems, the blood. The family problems. The blood. That's what is going on. You know? But it's like what I was telling you. <laughs> Even in the midst of a storm, we can still find rainbows. I still have reasons to be happy, just like you do. What's your reason? Going through what you are. <laughs> what can you possibly be happy about? Lots of things. For one thing, I still have my son. And I am very happy about that. <clears throat> Delilah, life will hand you lemons. Sometimes, all we can do is learn to make lemonade. You know what I mean? Did you take my advice? Yes. You lied to me. Did she really draw that? Hell no. Nah, that shit look like that's up in 3D, 4K HD. What? That's amazing. Yes. <laughs> Hell yeah. This is the Delilah I know. Bright, beautiful. Not dark and doomsday. Show that again. <sighs> now, all we have to do is work on your appearance next. <laughs> you can't be serious. You are going to enter that. Yeah. Why? Who shows a picture of their grandmother for an art contest? That is so cringe. Loser. <laughs> Ugh. Are, are you okay? My grandmother always wanted me to draw. But after, after she got cancer and died a year ago, I, I decided to join this contest for her. And now I just don't want to do it anymore. She just came in and took that boy whole spirit away. Crazy. Couldn't be me. Great attention to detail. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And this is Brooke. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> she has a very bright future ahead of her. Work. That's mm -hmm. right. Yeah. Outstanding work. Yes. I love, love the passion. Yeah, yeah. The passion and details. And the color. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Now let's go see Delilah's. Now, I got a little sneak peek earlier, and it is absolutely... Oh, my Are you... God. Don't tell me she ruined her painting again. Oh, Lord. Let's get back to this video. What happened? Man. Uh, this was so perfect earlier, before all the black streaks. I don't, I don't understand. Why would you do this? We'll talk about this later. 
This one is just going to have to be ruled out for now. Um, actually, I would like to know what her thinking was behind the streets, if that's okay. Uh, well, she just wanted originally I took Miss Strickland's advice and painted something bright and beautiful. But as you said before, art is supposed to make you feel something. And not everything feels like rainbows and butterflies all the time. I know for me, life has been more dark lately. You see, my parents were so in love. They were always happy and so cute with one another. But then... Things changed. They went from smiling all the time to arguing all the time. To the point where now they can't stand to be in the same room as each other. They've been talking about divorce. And it hasn't been easy on me. So you see, this painting represents my life. The parts in color represent the heavy times. But the black, the black represents the hard times. The struggles, the pain. Life isn't always perfect. And sometimes it feels like everything is dark. And it's hard to see the beauty. But I'm learning it's okay to feel this way, to have these emotions. It's a part of life. And depending on how you look at it, the darkness is what makes the color even more beautiful. I guess this painting is my way of saying, when life hands you lemons, you just have to make lemons. to pay our rent and we're two weeks away from getting evicted and moving into our car and just been really stressed out. I'm sorry. No. It's okay. But I am um, gonna take your advice and even in these dark times try to look at the bright side. I mean at least we have a car right? That some lemonade right there. Anyway, thanks again. Take care of yourself. Well, some of these stories start to get very intense and emotional, isn't it? Can you feel it? I can feel it. I have something for you. Oh, that's the end of the video. Okay, man. I'm not going to lie. I really enjoy watching this with y'all. Please let this message speak to y'all, man. Y'all never know what nobody going through. So I'm gonna treat everybody nice. If y'all enjoy watching this video with your boy Jamal, y'all know what to do. Hit the like button for me as well. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. I'll see y'all next video.